Crash Run. We are, of course, as always, dudes. Our rival's name. We lost to Surge, so of course his name is going to be Surge. What will it be? Will it be Rowlet? Will it be Poplio? Will it be Litten? Okay, it's a tie. It goes to a coin flip, chat. Heads for Poplio. Tails for Rowlet. Jesus Christ. Okay, I don't know where that went. <laughs> coin flip time. Here we go. Here we go. Heads is for Poplio. Tails is for Rowlet. And there it is. It's got decent IVs. Not great, but not bad either. A lot of Bs across the board. Like most of your guys' grades in high school. Here we go. What is our Viridian encounter? This is an important encounter. Okay, good. This is good. We like Mareep early. This is very helpful. Mayor. E. And it has a perfect special attack IV. Yes, sir. I like that a lot. Next encounter for Route 2. Okay, we've never gotten this one. We've never gotten Galarian Ponyta in any of our runs. This is not bad. Please be something good. Please be something good. Please be good. What the fuck is... Why does Doduo look like that? You're playing Infinite Fusion. I guess so. Like, what the hell is this? Did they just give Doduo... What the... F it's Fire Ground? Oh! <laughs> It's a ground type? Oh my god, this is perfect! Holy shit! Yes! Oh my god, this is perfect! Oh, chat, we just need to not throw. We need to not throw the run. Oh my god. We were just saying how we needed something like a Numel, but this is basically Numel, but faster. Okay. And it's another grass type. This is good. We're getting good. Okay. Okay. This is... Mmm. Our team is shaping up to be able to at least do something against Surge. If we can make it there. Any Ds this right? Nah, yeah, Tanch. We're getting there. Plenty of Ds opportunity. So we immediately go for will here. Excellent. I'm gonna go for a Flame Charge. Misses Slash. Huge. So this should be a pretty free kill, honestly. Even if we get hit here, this is fine because we have the Ornberry. It goes for Roost. We're going to swap in Kitty Ma to try to bait out the Emolga. Okay. Why would you send in the Corvus Wire? Should be good damage here. Never mind. Okay. We're making a play. Okay. There's the Emolga. This is fine. This is fine. We got Power Gem. This is where we have to stall out the Roosts. We've done this many times. There we go. Excellent. Emolga's dead. This is a GG. Once I got Flaffy in there for basically free, it was it was over. Brock leads with the Geodude. It's the Alolan Geodude. We're going to bait out uh, an electric type attack here. We're going to go into our Skidoo. I forgot to put an Ornberry on, but it's fine. It didn't use an electric type. It went for self-destruct. That is fine. We send back in Pig's Hat. Archon comes in. We go for Whirlpool. We Hello. Thank you. We go Bubble. There we go. Vulpix comes in. We go for Whirlpool again. It gets clapped. This is where we go with Mayor E. It's going to send in the Onyx. So I'm going to swap into Kitty Mott. There we go. We go for Water Gun. A couple of times here. Comes in. We Aqua Jet a couple times. Easy. Easy. What is our encounter? Why is Sad Song on? It's not sad. This is, this is hype. It's Pog. <gasps> yes! <laughs> Excellent! Oh, yes! We get Ekans again, boys! Yes! Oh, this is actually huge! Ekans went so hard for us last time. And that is a Sucker Puncher for the Raichu, which is a big threat for our team because it could have a Water-type move. Okay, this isn't awful, but I don't think... Well, if Palpitoad is part Ground-type, this is actually good. So far, these encounters have all been incredibly helpful. We got super lucky with our Wonder Egg. We have multiple things that can tank an electric type attack. That was our problem in the last run. We had nothing that could actually tank an electric type attack. But now, like, we've actually got to... If we can get Chin Chow again, too, like, dude. Dude, we have... Oh, perfect! Oh, my God, yes. Okay. Oh, I'm actually gonna nut, dude. We just got Swift Wings as well. Dude. This is exactly what I was asking for. And we got citrus berries. Like, dude. 
This is going so... I right, dude, if I throw this run, I'm going to be pissed. If I throw this run, oh, yeah, I'm going to be so pissed. What's in the egg? What's in the egg? Huge. Interesting. I'm not hyped. I'm not mad. It's just sort of an okay. We'll see what ability it has. Boof of these. Boosts power by 20% and speed by 50% in first turn? Okay, wait a minute. This could be big. Essentially, we could send this thing out turn one and just annihilate something. Okay, okay, this is this trainer, okay. It's the Greedent trainer, hold on. This is the person with the Clam Pearl. The Leech Seed. I don't think he has a fire move. He might have Ice Fang. He has Facade. That's fine, we can st- uh -huh. We use Synthesis, we heal. Excellent, Razor Leaf. Oh my god. Uh, it used its Citrus Berry. Ow, okay, it's fine. Uh, now we can send in freely our, this guy, Karate Chop. Holy shit. Um, it's fine, 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 totally fine. We intimidate here. We intimidate here to lower that attack. We go for a little bit of a screech. This is fine. We are not losing. We are fine. Of course you switch. Of course you switch. Of course you switch. Of course you switch. You're so cool. Thug attack. Massive kill. We are good. That means great. See? Easy. Easy, not even a worry. Not even a worry, it was that easy. Totally fine. Totally easy peasy, easy fine. Chat, important question by the way. I need some information and it's mostly around Caesar dressing. I need to know how many of you, one, like Caesar dressing and two, what you use it for. Your mother's salad. Okay, so besides that tanch, what do you use it for? All right, so. We start with Growlithe. We intimidate it here with Slitherpeen. I believe it goes for like incinerate here. Oh, it goes bulldoze. Wow, what a what a prediction. What a read. We go Thunder Wave. This will do about 40. It'll actually do exactly 40. But our citrus berry heals uh I think enough. Ooh. Oh, that's an orange berry. Never mind. It's fine. I think if I go Kitty Ma, he's gonna sub into Togemaru. Okay, sick. He just let me got the get the kill. That's this is best case scenario, to be honest. Now I can go into Slitherpeen once again for the Intimidate. Zippy Zap is fine. We go Screech. It's gonna go for Zippy Zap again. We go into our bird. And now it has to eat a hit with something. Okay, Gabite comes in. It is probably gonna go for a ground move, I imagine. We tank that easily. We're gonna get a Leech Seed out there. Now we go for Synthesis. Don't kill me. Thank you. And now it's going to go for Dual Chop again. I'm just going to go Synthesis again. Take some more health from it again. We can basically just stall this thing out. Okay. Goes into the Komala. That is fine. We're going to go Leech Seed again. Okay, this thing only has two attacks. It has Protect and it has Last Resort. Unfortunately, we don't have anything that can actually completely tank Last Resort anymore because we don't have a ghost type. Bulldoze to lower the speed if we survive. Okay, that's fine. Because we can go Brick Break for some pretty heavy damage. Okay, that's fine. Because we did get the damage. I think we're in the clear at this point. We get the kill here. He's gonna go back into Gabite. Okay, it didn't switch out. This is good. This is actually good. I like that it did not switch out. We're going to heal with this berry. We're going to Icy Wind to finish off the Gabite, and then that should guarantee that we win this. This guy sends in Togemaru. We go for... It doesn't really matter. We'll go Icy Wind to maybe control the speed, but we're going to die here anyways. We go for a Screech. We go for a Sucker Punch. Oh, apparently Zippy Zap always goes first. I don't know why Sucker Punch didn't go off. I guess... I don't know. There it is. That fight is very stressful. It is not a fun fight. It is very difficult, <laughs> but we did it. And we got Snubble. We were just talking about Snubble earlier. This is another Intimidator. Could definitely be worse. Um, also not great though. How about we name it Wubble because it's gonna be a massive dub. Wish they designed a better raid den. 
Yeah, that'd be kind of nice. No, no, no. Maybe it's better in this game. Maybe they made it usable. With strong jaw plus these moves, I think we should be fine. Just gotta level it up slightly here. And I gotta figure out, oh God, oh God. Oh God. I have saved recently. Okay, it was before. Oh, I have to do that fight again. Oh, that's annoying. All right, we're good. Holy shit, dude. Oh my god, okay. <laughs> See, we still pulled it off anyways, chat. We still clutched up, dude. All right, that's what matters. We'll get our fishing encounter for this route. <gasps> yes! Oh, uh, yes! Fuck yes. Oh, yes. Oh, chat, this is the run. This is the run. Name it the run, dude. 100%. We have gotten... I mean, we literally have gotten almost perfect encounters. As far as, like, stuff for Lieutenant Surge. Potentially access to Volt Absorb when it evolves. And if this thing gets Volt Absorb, even with the shitty IVs, it does not matter. If it gets Volt Absorb, this is a huge help for the Surge fight. And the hope is that we will get an ability capsule at some point here to help with a uh, lantern but if not it's okay this was a little tough last time but i think we're okay turns into an ice type goes for ice punch this does about 25 percent of our health yep using special moves on ai dude that's what i live for so she does have a lantern um it is a little bit cringe but we should be fine i think we just let slitherpeen die here we go for sucker punch because it has been screeched, we're just going to put immediate pressure on it with Razor Leaf. Oh, it does have an ice move, but it's Icy Wind. That's not too bad, I don't think. Razor Leaf, I think, kills after a screech. Yes. Ooh, and we got the crit, too. Huge. Honestly, crit mattered. <laughs> crit mattered. Starmie, we have plenty of options for. I think this thing also has Icy Wind. I'm going to see if I can't pull off a Leech Seed before we die. It has Aurora Beam. I think we're dead. Yeah, that's fine. We go for, we're gonna go crunch here. Scald is gonna hurt, but we do live at least one of those. A critical hit is a little annoying, but geez, man, like <laughs> we're good. Everything's great. This is gonna hurt. I think we live. Cause it's special attack isn't that great. Nice. We get paralysis here, we hit it with flash. And then if we don't kill it there, then Granbull comes in to finish it off. And it should be GG. Easy. Not bad, boys. Not bad. New encounter. Okay. Could be useful later on. I don't think it'd be useful for Surge, but it could be useful later on. Um, Power gem shouldn't kill. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's, fine. it's, fine. it's actually fine. It is actually fine. We didn't need it. We d Chat, we didn't need the Krabby. It's fine. <laughs> Power gem shouldn't kill, it's fine. <laughs> We're not choking this encounter. Ooh, Galarian Slowpoke? Okay. Uh, this could be a special defense tank. Not gonna lie. Why does it have piss on its head? Uh, because it was getting pissed on for a second there. We get another wonder egg chat. This could be a game changer. Moment of truth. Oh, yes! Yes! Oh, the game is blessing me today. This chat, this has to be the run. This has to be the run. This has to be the run. Dude. Oh, yes. I was gonna name this Spark though, cause it's like Spark Mandrill, but also it's sparking a new hope I never thought I had in this run. All right, let's, let's try to get another ground type here real quick. This time we're not choking because we have a quick ball. Get all that XP. Keep growing my sweet. Yes. 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 Oh, Ampharos time, everybody. Yeah. Ampharos. What shampoo do you use? Uh, I just wash with the muddy water outside. Oh, and we get Volt Switch. Yes. Oh, yeah. Oh, it does evolve. It evolve. Oh, yes. Yes. 
Yes! Oh my god. Look at him. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, dude. High horsepower? 95 power? Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Dude, this is the fucking run. <laughs> Nerf the team? No, 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 no. I don't know what's gonna happen after Surge, but we're gonna fuck Surge up. Ooh, Pancham. This is good for future stuff. This isn't great for now, but this is good for future stuff. I don't wanna kill this. This is a pretty decent encounter. Do not want to kill this. Let's send in the run to weaken it a little bit. Oh, no! I should use a quick ball. That's fine. It's fine. That's just embarrassing, dude. That's just, man, I should just use a quick ball. Okay, quick balls, berries, nugget. Yes! Holy shit! Ah! Yes! Yeah! <laughs> oh, it's the fucking run, boys! Ah, let's go, dude. Holy shit. It's the fucking run! Yes! What? An absolute stud day. This is this is the most promising run we have had. It at least has to get past Surge. It has to. At least. Okay? Chat, say hello to why we named this L'Oreal. <laughs> there it is. Oh, yeah. Hell, yeah. Shout out to the bowl cut, dude. <laughs> Ooh, I'll take a star you, though. Love star you. It's one of my favorite Gen 1 Pokemon. Patrick Star. <laughs> Battle this guy real quick. Fucking stupid ass Ice Q, stupid Pokemon. Shouldn't exist ass looking Pokemon. Hopefully we don't lose here. This is a bit of a tough fight. I have to play this nice and safe. Um, we are going to glare the Lilip immediately. And I am going to force this Cramorant to either die or switch out. It doesn't switch out. Easy. Holy shit. Oh, that's so nice of you. Oh, they just made it so easy. <laughs> Thank you, game. Thank you, AI. We'll take that freak. Are you for real? Docs help for a guy who's crap at Nuzlocks and another and another people use Docs, even other streamers are just built different. <laughs> uh, the last part's true. Uh, I am absolutely just built different, dude. <laughs> or something like that. I, I also just might be an idiot. That's also something to consider. But I mean, you know, who's to say? It's valid to play blind. Yep. Yeah. See, everyone, everyone's agreeing. Everyone's agreeing. It's just a Giga Chad gameplay here. When Pokemon becomes a numbers game, it starts to lose its fun. It needs that veil of fantasy and fun. I agree. Which is why we haven't been like heavily EV training or anything. Because it's just kind of meh. Because we are going to hit the Lilip with a Screech. And we're going to high horsepower the Nidoqueen and kill it. Because this bird is cracked. <laughs> it's just the best Pokemon of all time. We're going to go pluck here to take whatever berry it has. If it has a citrus berry, we just eat that. And it did not have a berry. How are you alive? You have one HP. That is kind of cringe. Oh, that's a dub. That's a dub. We did it. Everyone, we did it. Some Excadrill action going on. And it looks like he's flapping his wings. <laughs> There he is. The big boy. I'm so nervous. This is, I think, the most nervous I've ever been for a Pokemon battle. Like, this has to be the run. This has to be it. This has to be. It has to be. It just, it has to be. This is just the best luck we've had so far. I know that he starts with the little electric guy that sets up toxic spikes, which we don't like. Um... But we have two Pokemon that can switch into those. Actually, three that can switch into those just fine. I think this is the play. I can set up Mudsport turn one if he tries to switch out. I just don't... Here's the thing. I don't know what all he has. Like, all the moves. I know some of the moves that the Pokemon have, but I don't know all of them. So we just kind of have to hope for the best and see what happens. Alternatively, we could start with our Firebird and just nuke the first Pokemon. Because nothing could safely switch into that. You know what I'm saying? Though Spark is more important than L'Oreal. So we could lead with L'Oreal. And just... We have Soft Sand on it. 
We could lead with L'Oreal and just send it with like magnitude. <laughs> that might be the play actually. We can do this. We can do this. Come on. Come on, boys. Attempt number two of Surge. Now more than ever, I desperately need magnitude to cooperate because it probably has a thing. It has that defense thing and it has probably a berry. Actually, that was probably the berry. Come on, come on. Magnitude seven, not bad. Is that enough though? Probably not, right? Not enough. It goes for Scald. We probably die. Okay, that's fine. Because now we can go, we know we outspeed with Spark. So we, we prevented Toxic Spikes from going down at all. So now we should be able to bulldoze just fine. Get the free kill. He probably switches into Manectrike. He is going to Mega Evolve, um, which is kind of cringe. But no matter what he really does here, um, if he goes Flamethrower, we either one of these are fine. If he goes for an Electric Move, either one of these are fine. See, the only thing is I don't know. I know it has Hidden Power. And I don't know what typing its hidden power is. It's either grass, water, or ice. Because we know that it did super effective damage to Dawn Fan. I'm going to tentatively switch in the run. Okay, it gets re-intimidated, but that's fine. Goes for Flame Burst. Sorry, not Flamethrower. We tank that. Now comes the tricky part, because we don't know exactly what it's going to go for. It's probably Hidden Power. I'm gonna go for damage, I'm gonna go for Scald here. Okay, Hidden Power, if this is... Okay, so it's Grass. We can confirm that it's Grass, which is good. Oh, the burn! Oh my God, huge! Oh, yes! Oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, dude. That burn is massive. I'm going to send in the goat just to get an extra turn of burn on this thing. Yep. Yep. Sap Sipper plus the burn. Electric Terrain's gone. This thing has to switch, right? Surely it has to switch. There's the Volt Switch. So whatever comes in next has to get hit with a, a powered up Bulldoze. Ooh, or it's just a Vika Volt that I can't hit. I forgot it had Vika Bolt. That's the Pokemon I forgot about. Okay, this is fine. Um, so this is a bug type, bug electric with levitate. It's probably going for a bug type attack, I imagine. It shouldn't have anything against our Firebird. I am going to send in the bird, I think. I think it's time. It shouldn't have anything here for this. It tries for Volt Switch, perfect. Wait, if it was going for Volt Switch, is that all it has? What else does it, wait, wait, hold on. <laughs> I'm going back in here. Wait a minute. Okay, it has Energy Ball. That's all it's got, okay. Okay, wait a minute. If it's going for Volt Switch here. Oh, we're faster? Wait, what? Okay, that's fine. I didn't know we were faster than this thing. Okay, Bolton comes in. This thing I believe has Fire Fang. Dude, this could be a huge play actually. Check this out, check this out. Check it out. Intimidate hits. Lowers the attack, okay? It goes for Fire Fang, right? Ice Fang, that's fine. Same thing, basically. No freeze, excellent. Now it's gonna try to switch out. We go for Screech. Okay, it's throwing, excellent. <laughs> excellent, that's perfect. It went for for Thunder Fang. I mean, sick, okay, Thunder Punch, or uh, Sucker Punch. Huge. Now it's basically trapped in here. We go Sucker Punch again. Free kill, basically. That's like, I think it's fastest Pokemon, so that's great. Now that's off the table. Vika Volt comes back in. It's gonna go for Volt Switch. Check out the play. Check out the healing play right here. Uh-huh. And watch this, it's gonna go for Energy Ball. Uh-huh. There it is. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. We synthesis here for the free healing turn. It's going to Volt Switch out. Are you an EV trainer? No. No, I've done hardly... The only EV training I've done is when I get the um, 
the EV training items from the like the raid dens. That's pretty much it. I haven't done any EV training beyond that. See, now I'm very curious what this goes for. The Alolan Raichu was a pain in the ass for us last time, but now I'm very curious what it goes for. We know it has Volt Switch. We don't know much else of what it has. We are boosted with our attack though, so I am going to go for a Bulldoze. Okay, it went for Volt Switch. Which tells me that he's basically out of options here. Oh, this is excellent. Is he going to go for Volt Switch again? So I'm just going to heal. <laughs> there. Okay. Okay. Oh, this is big. Does he go back into Raichu? Because if that's the case, I just get to switch out here. I could go into a couple of different options here. Because this is just free heals at this point. Yeah, it's going for Volt Switch. Free heal with Volt Absorb. I don't know. I think this thing might have Grass Knot. So I kind of want to test that theory with the signal beam here. Nasty plot. Okay. That's a little scary. <laughs> I don't love that, but this should do big damage. Probably like half its health. Solid. I know we scared it away with this, so we're going to switch back here in the event that it goes for a Volt Switcher or, I don't know, something. Side Shock. That's going to hurt. That's going to hurt. Hey, 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 hey. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. This is pretty much a guaranteed kill regardless. Gives us a free switch into Slitherpeen. We have Sucker Punch on this. No matter what it tries to use here, it has to eat a Sucker Punch. Dead. Big. Big. Ooh, big. At this point, Slitherpeen's job has been done. It, it does not have much of a job anymore. We just go for damage with Sucker Punch. It has done its job. Its purpose has been fulfilled. I think this is where we go into our Firebird. I think this is the sweep. And we're faster. And we're faster. Oh, it's over, dude. Oh, it's so over. Dude. Oh, this feels so good. This feels so good. Yes, dude. Yes. This thing's about to get shit on. <laughs> get pissed on. Yeah, have your berry. Have your berry. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It's over, dude. Next turn. Oh, that's Jeej. That is Jeej. Nice damage, dude. Get shit on. We've done it, boys. <laughs> we got past Surge, baby! Mm, let's go. Oh, that is massive. Oh, that feels so good. Oh, yes. <sighs> That's so nice. Surge has been officially taken care of. We did not white out. That's a dub. This is officially the furthest any of our runs has ever gotten. Monumental moment. Monumental moment. Now, we have to think ahead here. The next gym is technically Erica. Which I'm sure is going to be so much fun to go against.